The topic we took is energy and transportation. We are going to do a project in which we are using plastic to make petroleum. Let's see how. So to start, we need a can. We have pierced two holes in which we can insert all the plastics too. Plastic cause harm to humans, animals and plants through toxic pollutants. It can take hundred or even thousands of years for plastic to break down so the environmental damage is long lasting. It affects all organisms too. After inserting all of the plastic into the hole, we are going to cover it with the pipe. So we have placed it in a slanting manner and we are going to stick it to the can using M seal. After sticking it, we covered the other hole too with M seal. After we have connected the pipe to a plastic wire and then we pierced two holes into a glass bottle and we inserted the pipe too. Then we are going to cover the pipe holes too with M seal so that it is airtight. After we covered the connection between the wire and the pipe with M seal so that there is no air coming out. Preparations are over. Now let's start the experiment. Open the ice for the condensation process. Now let's start. We have started a fire and kept the container containing all the plastic to the fire. After a while, we notice some smoke coming out from the jar. We had to condensate that to make petroleum. And we could also see some water droplets forming on the plastic wire. After a while, yes, we could see the petrol. We had to wait for a while so that the petrol condensates and forms inside the jar. We could see petroleum falling from the pipe and condensating to form the actual petrol. After a while, we opened the jar to find some petrol. Now we have to check whether it can burn. So we poured it on a plate and we have to check it if it is real petroleum. Yes, it did make a flame. Our experiment did work. This is not the pure form of petrol, but this can be used in future. We know plastic is just a crude oil that have been processed in different way with pyrolysis. We can revise this process. Plastic pyrolysis is an effective way in which plastic is exposed to high temperature in an oxygen free environment. Pyro means heat and lysis means breakdown at any temperature. Emission it reduces the risk of water pollution and creates new jobs for lower income people based on the quantities of waste generated in the region which in turn provide public health benefits through waste cleanup and etc. And this is how waste plastic is turned into usable resource. The plastic is converted into 80% oil, 15% gas and 5% carbon black.